Hey guys, what's the Mind Detective here coming at you with another mine exploring video. So this is my, I'm not even counting at this point, but it's like my fourth or fifth trip to this particular mine. Here's looking up this uh, inclined shaft. Right now we're on the 200 foot level and I'm here with my buddy Nick. And then uh, here's looking down the right hand drift of this 200 foot level. Already uh, checked that out in previous videos. I'll leave a link in the top right so you guys could check that out but we're gonna go continue down this incline shaft check out the 300 foot level and hopefully connect to one of the nearby mines so let's get down there all right guys so we're down here on the 300 foot level and I uh, found this Prince Albert tobacco tin but Nick took a look inside of this and apparently there's a whole bunch of uh, these old matches that uh, at least two dozen in there I'll put that back close the lid and then right here we got I believe these are called single jacks you just have a uh, rock hammer and then hit that up against the rib of the mine it's a very small one Still pointy after all these years. And then, uh, oh yeah, also found this homemade hoe. Looks like they just, uh, I don't even, I don't even know if they, yeah, they definitely welded that. But, yeah, that's sick. They would have probably, uh, mucked up the sections on the mine like this. Yeah, just grabbing all the rock along with it. Homemade hoe. <laughs> Super cool. And I piece off a dynamite box right here. Just end off a drill bit. Got a chisel end on it. Uh, looks like a skip car wheel right here. sides of it are broke off. Yeah, look how worn that thing is. And the random book on Scandinavia. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we will be heading down this drift and uh, hopefully connecting to that other mine. Alright, so there's looking back towards the main haulage on the 300 foot level, and we will continue down this way. Is that a newspaper? Uh, what's that say? California Bungalow. Is there a year? Uh -huh, I'm to get it. Huh. Cool looking house. Thanks. Leave that right there. Pocket off this way. Oh, dude, look at this graffiti. I do the rest of this level on the way back. I mean. Yeah, I remember I did that way. I think that way actually connects back to this way, but this one's like way more, you know, clear. Yeah. Oh, don't Oh, nice. You see me pretty? Oh, Hercules. Oh, another Prince Albert. Hell yeah. No, it's not Prince Albert. Ah. What is uh, that? There's a little gold showing. Hmm. Can't really read that. I think that's a tuxedo brand. You know, or you remember the green one? It says tuxedo. Yeah. I see, I definitely see a D-O, but it's very, uh, very worn out. Usually don't see the tuxedo brand ones, so that's cool. There's definitely a lot of stuff off to the sides here. Maybe some better condition ones. Huckleberry Finn. There's a year 1920. Breathing all 
sudden. Yeah. It's kind of humid in here. You can see like all this kind of rotted wood. Oh, no, that's because of fire. All right, was it left? Fire will make it humid in here. Left or right? All right, let's keep right. Oh man, look at all this rock fall. Yeah, look at that nasty horseshoe. Yo, somebody wrote on this. What are they doing math? There's like nails. It's like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday. Look, it's a it's a fucking calendar, dude. Oh. Yeah, it says 30. Hmm. Keeping track of the days, I guess. Wild. Dude, look at this ore chute. This thing's like completely collapsed. Yeah, this section is kind of nasty. Not doing super hot, huh? Nah. I wonder why. I think there's other mines in this area that are the same age, but also much drier and less. Another collapsed ore chute. Yeah, that's a lot of wetness might be from the fire, too. And then I think we take another left. Here's the top of a tobacco tin. Check that out later. Yeah, this one that just branched off a lot of weird ways, huh? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. There's track, so I think I think it's to the left. Oh, actually, you feel that air? There's like a little, but I think I feel air. Owl. That's an ugly owl. Alright, here we go. There we go. 1927. Oh, yeah. Or is that RC, GC, both 1927? Up that section right here. Oh, dude, I definitely remember that pipe sticking down. Oh, yeah. Alright, so made it here to this uh, little section where we gotta crawl through, and then that uh, other shaft is just probably 50 or 100 feet that direction. So, uh, let us get through there. Oh yeah. Crawling. <laughs> Alright. So we just crawled through that section. Oh dude, look at this door shoot. It's a square. Yeah, I keep seeing ones like that. That's a cool little one. Alright, just keep going on this way. Tell lots of uh, water and mud have came down here 
in the past. Oh, this is cracked up. The type of rock you're supposed to be super poor, so once winter, the water's going to go right through it. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's looking up into this stove. Oh, what the hell? Dude, are those dynamite boxes over there? Looks like there's a bunch of boxes. Alright, so there's a looking back where we came from. And here is the uh, one of the connecting shafts. Uh, we're going to go down one of the drifts and then that connects to another incline shaft. And that one is uh, decently extensive. It goes at least probably 300 feet up and down. So going to check that one out. Hopefully find way more artifacts. Maybe a skip car or dynamite boxes. Who knows? Start going up this. Uh, looks like a couple of rungs are missing on the back side of this ladder, but oh, I'm just gonna skip that. Uh, looks like there's a little stope that goes up in there, stole or two. Timber? On the right? Yeah. I didn't. Like the way it's splintered makes me wonder if it was all from blasting or just like material falling from that ore shoot up there. Yeah, I don't know. There's an ore shoot to your right. Oh dude, yeah, I seen that. There's another one of these squared off ore shoots. It gets narrower as it goes down. That's cool. Oh, there's a, uh, there's like the frame off a wheelbarrow. That's cool. Yeah, so here's a, here's a frame off a wheelbarrow. Um, what the hell is that? Just keep oh it. Yeah. No way it hoisted that whole thing. Oh, hey, it's more of those. More of those fallout shelter can thingies. There's a boot. Oh, that's the one I was talking about. Oh my god. Cool little shoe. The original. Dude, look at that. I Super old rivets in the heel plate. Dude, look at how nasty that, that other section looks. That's why it's all fucked up, huh? Yeah. And then that ladder about 40 or 50 feet up gets more vertical. Who doing this made this hole? Got a hose down there. Well, that's sketchy. Logged up or sheet. Another stoop. Oh yeah, this is definitely it. Remember I told you about all the trash down this one? What day he you? Los Angeles, California. Engineering news record. Lots of engineering news records. Where did all fucking come from? I have no clue. Why? Oh, dude, some of this stuff's decently old. A 1962. Southwest Builder and Contractor. Yeah, lots of this stuff looks like it dates to the 1960s. 
I'm pretty sure like they had like a fallout shelter as well. Probably had like rations in these cans. Oh dude! I found uh what is rolls of film? Oh no, this is tape. Never mind. I thought it was rolls of film. So I got some tape. A whole bunch of it. Yeah, there's just so much here. I've never seen a guy in my box like this. Card cardboard or Hercules Gelamite. Oh je oh je gelamite? I don't know. Oh, dude, yeah. oh, look, it's a jar. Not that old, I think. Oh no, that's decently you know old. We came up. No, this this is another one. This is the this was the main connection we're looking this for. Go down? Uh, I think we're probably like on the hundred or hundred fifty foot level, and that probably goes down another two hundred feet. This is a decently old bottle. I think that. Have you ever been down there? Oh uh, no, I haven't. That's why we're here. <laughs> um, looks like that's an Owens, Illinois jar. Has a seven. Oh, has a seven as a date code. I'm guessing 1947, probably. Oh, oh I see the surface. Oh yeah. Is this the uh, the other connection you're talking about? Yeah, this is it. So this would take us out into Yeah, into the sunlight, into the buildings. So continuing down this uh right hand drift off of that main incline shaft, uh got some track right here. And then right here we got a pretty nice uh fault line as this uh foot wall and then that Hanging wall is pretty flat as well. You got this wood retaining wall blocking all that rock from coming down here. Just look at that. It's so smooth. Continuing down the track. Oh, there's a cool piece of graffiti. What's that say? Shorey and Macy 1940. That's cool. Got a small ore chute right here. Nick continued down. Got some buckling timbers right here. Oh, wow. Oh, that's all pretty dang cool. Oh, yeah? Not a whole lot going on in this section, except for one thing. Ooh. That goes off that way. Look down that hole. Ooh, this one? Yeah, dude, I think this contained oh, a lamp. Yeah. Oh, there's a shovel. Literally leaning up <laughs> as if they're gonna come back to fuck work. Huh. How do we get down there? <laughs> I have no idea. I thought maybe that way. Yeah, does that connect to that? I don't, yeah, even I think don't know if that's a safe or feasible way. So probably from the bottom. Does this continue? Look at that. It looks like bark. Well, I'll go on this and see if there's anything. Oh, looks like that ends. Oh, but there are some cool pieces of newspapers. The Los Angeles Times. Let's see if there's a year on this one. Nope. Lots of cool pieces here. 
This one says Wrigley Double Double Chew Gum. Cool advertisement right there. There's another piece. There's a whole bunch of pieces here. Looks like that hole continues down. And that just faces. All right, so here's looking down that trashy section of the mine, but uh, we're gonna start heading up Sinclair shaft. It's about at the same angle as the other one, probably 45, 50 degrees right around there. Yeah, I can see the daylight from here. All right, uh, looks like we got an electrical box right here. Very interesting. Um, got a couple of coffee cans. God damn. Did he die? A little bit. Oh, my bad. Uh, let's see. Yeah, just lots of lots of trash thrown all around here. Propane tank here. M MGB coffee, that's decently old. Probably 60s. Mm -mm, is that a fire extinguisher? Hey, I found a fire extinguisher. Looks like this is the next level right here. I believe this is the 100 foot level. Interesting. Got a big old tire right here. Bunch of modern trash all around here. Older and newer stuff all around. Here's a cool drill steel. Where'd you go? Right, uh, right here to the left. Yeah, lots. Yeah, so this is a uh, pretty trashed up section of the mine. I got a flare right here. It's pretty interesting. Lots and lots of mod modern trash. Definitely looks like they reopened this mine probably back in the 80s or 90s. Lots of modern PVC pipe. Mixed in with older, older newspaper and pieces of dynamite, drill steel, all that. But yeah. <laughs> you got this little tykes, old dinosaur thing with the helmet on. It's kind of funny. Alright, let's uh, continue on. Here's another helmet. I think it's pretty beat to shit. Oh, some cool little gobbing right here under this ore chute. There's a uh, Union Carbide can. Miner's Lamp Union Carbide. Pretty nice color on that one. It's all jangled up, but cool to see. Ah. Where's 
Street says number one. Holy shit. Hey, what is that? Is that a slusher bucket? Or what the hell is it? It is. Hey, that's a big one. Sick. So we got a slusher bucket. The cable that would have pulled it along would have been right around here. That's a big hefty one. Did you just hook it up to a mirror or something? No, they probably would have had a hoist. Oh my so god, that's like install like a temporary hoist or have a hoist on a cart? Yeah, you know like uh that hoist that like me and Owen found? Kinda like that. Yeah. Yeah, and then they would have just uh you know, had that running and then it would have uh you yeah, know, went up and down the drifts. So this level is nice. Oh dude, this track is sick. Let's hope for an ore car. <laughs> That's a pretty good sign seeing a slusher. Hmm. There's still lighting. That's a super new light bulb right there. What the hell? Very nice small piece here of uh Ooh, there's a newspaper. More hose units for drills. You got a newspaper from 1984. Well, that tells you probably when they worked this mine. Ooh. You did it. Yeah. That's what I was guessing, 80s and 90s. Track continues on. Got some cable here. Hey, you got an Outlet's Powder Company in my box. 40% strain. That's way more water. Oh, yeah. Well, the same time period, 80s. Look these safety goggles. <laughs> There's a cool little workstation. Ow. Oh, dude, this is like probably where the uh, fuse cord was, you know, wrapped around. Go. Milk carton. Oh, dude, we got a wheelbarrow. The uh, mine idea in Sonora with all the drills and stuff is kind of like this. Like it started old and then somebody worked it and mm -hmm. there's like drills. But we're getting way more yeah. drill related. And a wheelbarrow. And it had little pit stops like this all over the place. It was like old to new. Yeah, this is a nice wheelbarrow. Let's step in off that old. Ah, yeah, that shit's 80s, <laughs> 70s. Huh? My grandma had the exact same one. <laughs> oh, look, they got a grease. Grease bucket and the grease sticks. Uh, oh, look at Hercules. Hercules in it. Oh my god, dude, look at that. Hercom one. Ooh. Oh, that smells like ass. Well, that's what we're smelling, dude. There's more drill. Drill hose. Uh, dude, where's the whole drill at? Oh, dude, there's a bunch of stuff. There's a ladder, splitting the rail. Oh, yeah, we got a bunch going on here. Oh, dude, here's a hoist. Oh, yeah. There's a super modern hoist. Uh, what is it? These are much fresher timbers. Look, there's a note. Cap, there is a dog tooth gear brake on the tugger so you don't have to pull the bucket all the way up. Dude, look at this little hoist. Still got the cable? There's actually the Hercules shit in that. Wow. That's sweater. 
This is it. Looks like that just ends. Little baby horse. Look. Let's go. Then there's a there's a wind going down. Alright, you let me know when. Alright, go. I think that's PVC. Ow, bitch. This one actually has the door. No <laughs> fucking way. What the hell happened here? All right, so looking up, we're about 40 or 50 feet from the surface. So we're gonna pop up, check out some of the surrounding structures, and then uh, check out the lower levels of this one, and then uh, that'll be pretty much it. All right, guys. Been a while since I recorded. Uh, seen a couple of artifacts in the uh, other drifts, but nothing really to write home about. Uh, but right here, we're at the bottom, at least for now, of this uh, inclined shaft. Now that is not the sump. That is actually a collapse. There's a bunch of rock fall right there. So that is pretty much the end of this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one, uh, definitely a long day, I don't know how many hours we've been down here, but we're definitely uh, going to get some in and out or something after this, <laughs> but uh, yeah, oh, man, I'm tired, <laughs> alright well, peace out Nick, I appreciate you coming along and such, hell yeah, but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one, please like and subscribe and thank you for watching.